What's going on guys? So I haven't made a video for a few weeks now but I'm back. Um, I've been really busy with work and waiting for parts to arrive but I've got a few now. I've still got a few on the way in the mail. They should be here probably a couple of weeks. I had to order those from the States. But right now I'm heading to Melbourne to Pakenham. Uh, I've got a guy there, he's hooked me up with a fuel system, fuel cell, fuel pump and a few other things. So I'm heading there now to pick those up so I'll show you when we get there. Alright guys, so hopefully you can hear me. We made a pit stop on the way home. Uh, some waterfalls, so I wanted to come see them. So we're here. Uh, see behind me. Right there. Pretty big. Ish. So yeah, I'll show you some more. And then we'll get home and uh, put some stuff in. Look at all that pool, Alright, so that's us done. Wasn't a bad walk, probably about 2Ks. A lot of waterfalls. Um, but we're going home now, and I'll show you all the stuff that I brought today and unbox it and uh, maybe mock it up in the car. So we're finally back home, so I'll get everything out of the car and I'll show you what we got. Alright guys, so this is what I got. I got a Aeroflow 044 pump pump bracket and a 57 litre airflow fuel cell uh, it's black anodized so it's E85 and methanol safe I'm just going to run regular fuel but it's always nice to have the option of running E85 in the future um, all this stuff is supplied by Prohose Performance Fittings a uh, guy named Josh owns a business is awesome knows his shit and just really helped me out with everything I wanted to know um, I'll link his Facebook down in the description. You should guys should go check him out. He's more than happy to help you out with anything you possibly want. All right, so that's what I got. Um, I'll get to unboxing it now. Uh, big thanks to Josh. Just great job. Okay, so this is the pump. Comes with all the uh, fittings and the pump. The normal pump. So let's get on to what I've been waiting for the most and opening this fuel cell. So this is the fuel cell. Pretty happy with it. Looks good. Uh, it's got a fuel sender, returns, and then it also has a bottom sump. Uh, the fuel so yeah I thought it came with uh, foam on the inside but it hasn't so I might buy some of that just to stop some of the sloshing around when I'm sideways alright so that's all I got today uh, I've still got a few other things bits and pieces like fuel line fittings and stuff that I have to get but I just got the basics for now so I can mock everything up and just get it in the car then I can go back later and put everything else that I need in um, I'll probably put up another video of me mocking it up in the back of the car where it's going to sit, the heights and everything and just show you what else I've got going on with the car. Uh, thanks for watching. Go check out my Instagram, sideways underscore down under. Post up. I try to post up as many pictures as I can. Uh, it's a bit slow at the moment just because I haven't done much with the car. But now that I've got some parts rolling in, I should be well underway with uh, everything I have to. Probably about three weeks away from getting the motor and the box put in, getting all the engine mounts mocked up, all that sort of stuff. So look forward to that. I know I am. Yeah, thank you.